Are you looking for a great video editor, but you don't want to pay good money for something you might not use and you certainly don't want to be tied to a subscription? What if I told you that one of the very best video editors has amazing media management, comes with audio and VFX tools, can render all types of video and is a world-class color grading tool. And it's totally free. Of course, I'm talking about DaVinci Resolve and let me show you why this is by far the best option in my opinion. DaVinci Resolve is a complete video editing and processing suite with a very competent free option. Resolve is very much a professional tool and has been used to edit feature films like Star Wars, The Last Jedi, Pirates of the Caribbean, La La Land and TV shows like The Walking Dead and of course tons of music videos and commercials. There are two versions of the software, DaVinci Resolve Free and DaVinci Resolve Studio. Both versions are available for Windows, Mac OS and Linux. Plus there is a free iPad version on the App Store and an upgraded iPad version for $95. You can use the free version of DaVinci Resolve to edit video on a timeline, cut up video and audio, color grade your footage, apply visual effects, master audio and render and share your project. I made a video that points out some of the biggest differences between the free version and the studio version that you can check out here. And why do I claim that DaVinci Resolve is the best free video editor? Well, DaVinci Resolve is a professional video editing product that incorporates and expands on many of the features you find in paid or subscription apps like Adobe Premiere and Final Cut. You may find that you'll never need more advanced features than what DaVinci Resolve already gives you in the free version, especially if you're just starting with video production. DaVinci Resolve is a complete video solution, though it does things a little differently from the competition. This is especially evident in the app's layout, which uses different workspaces or pages that you can see in tabs at the bottom for different functions. The workspaces or tabs are split up into a media browser where you can preview and import all your media including videos, photos and audio. The cut page. With its simplified interface you can think of it as a cutting desk for fast turnarounds or a place where you can make your rough cuts. Edit page. A great non-linear editor with a standard timeline view, multi-track layout and drag and drop support. Fusion page is where you can add visual effects like motion graphics, 3D camera tracking and more advanced VFX and the color page. A world class color grading tool. A lot of people move to Resolve for this page alone. It's remarkably good and is the color grading tool of choice for professionals all over the world. Fairlight. This is a post-production audio mastering tool which Blackmagic Design compares to a standalone digital audio workstation. This is where you can do all professional editing and mixing of your audio. And finally, the liver page, you can export and render out your final videos here. You can render them out individually or you can add them to a queue and just start the render whenever you're ready. So this might sound like a lot, but you certainly don't have to use all of what DaVinci Resolve has to offer. If you're only interested in editing videos, just import your media and do your work in the cut or edit pages and then head to the deliver page to render out your project when you're done. You can easily switch between the cut and the edit page and you can do your rough cut in the cut page and then fine tune your timeline on the edit page. Anything you do in one page will automatically be updated on the other pages and you can just jump back and forth. The Fusion, Color and Fairlight pages are each worthy of being a standalone app as they all do very specific things and they can easily take years to master. But don't be alarmed if they're seemingly advanced interfaces. It's very easy to get started with them. And if you want to learn more about each of them, I will highly recommend that you start with Blackmagic's own free training. They're really a great place to start and after completing them, you'll feel fairly comfortable in all of the pages. If you want to make the most of DaVinci Resolve, you'll need two things. First, Find some great tutorials focused on the things you need as you progress and as you need them. I have a lot of different tutorials on this channel and there's so many other great videos out there on YouTube. The second thing you'll need is obviously to spend time in Resolve. The more time you spend, the more things will stick and the more questions you will have, which will lead you to learn even more. 
And although Resolve can seem intimidating at first, if you just focus only on the things you need to do, it will quickly become less intimidating and you start to appreciate just how great a tool DaVinci Resolve is. Obviously, you don't get all the bells and the whistles of the studio version with the free version. The studio version comes with extra features like noise reduction, the ability to use multiple GPUs for rendering, AI tools like magic masks and relighting, export of 4K and higher resolutions and lots of visual effects. Some of these features like noise reduction, I find is worth the price alone. Many of these features you can still try out in the free version. You'll just get a watermark on your footage, but it's always a good idea to start out in the free version. And if you ever find you need any of the paid features, you can always upgrade later and you can continue any project that you created in the free version directly on the studio version. And finally, one of the very unique and amazing things about Resolve is that you have the whole pipeline from importing media, creating a rough cut, editing, color grading, and audio and VFX tools right up until final delivery. So basically the whole workflow in one piece of software. It's quite amazing and that means less potential for issues and it will save you a lot of time. So thanks for watching and if you found this video helpful, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more exciting tutorials and tips and smash that like button. It really helps getting the content out there. Thanks a lot. Catch you on the next one.